ASCH is the result of pop smear that sounds rather crazy. ASCH stands for atypical squamous cells cannot exclude high-grade intraepithelial lesion. As is obvious from its name, ASCH carries higher risk of cervical neoplasm but lower than HSIL. As is well known, HPV infection is the identified cause of cervical neoplasm. In other test results, running the HPV test was a recommended step, uh, such as in ASCIS or LSIO. However, in case of ASCH, HPV testing is deemed inappropriate because HPV detection rate is very high in ASCH. Even though the HPV test turns out to be negative, five-year cancer risk amounts to 2%. Then how should ASCH be managed? Regardless of age and risk stratification, colposcopy is recommended. Again, HPV testing is not recommended. Mostly, the histology result will be CIN2 to 3, which needs treatment. The patient may be treated with either an excisional procedure such as cone biopsy or LEEP um, or by an ablated procedure such as cryotherapy or CO2 laser. Cervical neoplasm is mostly asymptomatic. However, with adequate screening and diagnosis, its survival is increasing. For a further study on this subject, my previous videos are recommended. Thank you for listening, and I'll come back again to finally talk about HSIL. See you!